Hey guys, Dan here with Battlefield Curator. And if you're looking to get an M1 Garand, you came to the right place. We're going to talk to you about how to get one through the CMP, the Civilian Marksmanship Program. So currently, one of the best military surplus deals you can get is the M1 Garand. But when I tell folks this, their response is, huh? I'm not paying thousands of dollars for an M1 Garand. That's way too much. Well, have you heard of the CMP? You can get a M1 Garand for really cheap through the CMP. Usually the answer is no, they haven't heard of the CMP or that sounds like a lot of paperwork. I don't really want to do all that paperwork. Okay, so yes, there's some eligibility requirements and a little extra paperwork to do, but it's really quite simple. So let's break it down. There are two ways to get an M1 Garand through the CMP. The first way is to go to the stores in person, and the second way is through mail order. We will discuss each option later in the video, but for now, let's look at the eligibility requirements, aka just to make sure you're not an idiot. Here's the checklist. Proof of US citizenship. Proof of age. Membership in a CMP affiliated organization. Marksmanship or firearms related activity. All right, so proof of citizenship can be like a passport or a birth certificate, official government document, military ID, and some of those can also suffice as proof of age, but a certified driver's license will be best. Okay, so here's the part that sounds tricky, but it's actually really easy. Membership in a CMP affiliated organization. There are well over 2,000 organizations that are affiliated with the CMP. If you're currently serving in the military, Proof of that will count as being part of a CMP affiliated organization. If you're not in the military, we have found that the Grand Collectors Association is your best option. If you go to their website and sign up, it's an annual $25 a year. They automatically send your membership information to the CMP and you get some coffee table reading material. Okay, so now moving on to marksmanship or other firearms related activity. If you served in the military or police force, that will count as firearms related activity. Provide proof of that and you should be good. If not, look through the list that they have on their website and find something that you can use. But if you don't see anything that you can use, it's probably best to just go ahead and get a concealed carry license. You do this by going to your local county website to find out info on how to get a carry license. Okay, and lastly, you gotta be able to pass a NICS background check and meet state and local requirements. Okay, so let's say you got your documents on how to prove your eligibility. Let's look at ways that you can make this purchase. The first way is that you can go to their stores in person and bring the documents for the eligibility requirements. They have a few stores. The South Store is in Anniston, Alabama. Just a little further west is the Talladega Marksmanship Park Firing Range, or the TMP. They also sell M1 Garands there. Then there's the North Store, which is located in Port Clinton, Ohio. Check out the cmp.org to get store hours information. The second way is to order through mail order. Okay, so go to the cmp.org, drag your mouse over sales and service tab, then click ordering information. Scroll down and read the information on the page and download the CMP universal order form. What you want to do is you want to fill in your information on form 1A. If you signed up for the Grand Collectors Association, write GCA in the Club and State Association. Sign and date and Form 1A is complete. Now, Form 2A, you have to get notarized. There are quite a few places to go get a notary public, so don't let this deter you. These places include a bank, photocopy shop, parcel store, DMV, or county offices. Okay, Form 3A is your order form. Now it's time to pick an M1 Garand. On the CMP website, drag your mouse over the sales and services. Now click rifle sales. At the bottom, click read more on the M1 Garand. Scroll through and read about the grading conditions. Rack grades and field grades will be the cheapest. Service grades are in better condition, but just a tad bit more in price. Scroll down and find the one you are looking to get. Field grades are a good choice for condition and value. Now annotate the one you want on the order form. You can also list ammo or other accessories. Now add up the cost and write in your card information. Use page 4A as a checklist for your order packet. Gather all your documents and order form paperwork and send it to the CMP through snail mail. So there you have it. How to order an M1 Garand through the CMP. Hope you like this video and be sure to pulverize that like button and subscribe. 
really helps out with the channel. Oh, and if you want to get up-to-date information about the CMP, make sure you check out their website and their forums. Make sure you check out some of the other videos on my channel. And if you really like content like this, go check us out on Instagram and Facebook. Make it a great day, guys.